the BTV Newscast. Now let's go interview Mr. Bodie about what would happen if we had a snow day. What are the snow day procedures? Yeah, that's a great question. As we get into the winter months here and the weather, possibility of uh, severe weather coming in with snow, um, there's a possibility of e-learning days. So if you do have an e-learning day, um, the procedures for students are to make sure you have the Teams app downloaded on your iPad and to attend every class period for that day. Now, with that being said, there is a different schedule that we will be following with students and uh, BT will be showing this after this presentation uh, as well as being emailed to your parents. But the, the schedule is a little different, but is it expected that all students attend every class all day? Now let's go interview Mr. Houth about Martin Luther King Day. Okay, what is Martin Luther King Day? Martin Luther King Day is a holiday we observe and celebrate in January where we celebrate and remember Dr. Martin Luther King, who was an important civil rights leader in the middle of the 1900s. And uh, like I said, just honoring and remembering that legacy of Dr. King. And why do we take that day off? If I remember correctly, the day is observed as like a day of service to give back to the community and help others. So if you can, if there's an opportunity to uh, do a service project or help the community, it would be a great thing for MLK Day. Thank you. Question of the week. Who am I here with? Quinn Wason. And what did you do over winter break? I went to Florida. That's fun. Who am I here with? Anya. And what did you do over winter break? Uh, I hung out with my friends and hosted a New Year's party. Who am I here with? Hayden. And what did you do over winter break? Mm -hmm. I had a volleyball tournament. Fun. Who am I here with? Lily Reinhardt. And what did you do over winter break? I went to Florida and hung out with my friends. Awesome. Who am I here with? Mr. Gilpin. And what are you most excited for for the next semester? You know, uh, there's always a lot of excitement for the second semester because we are already halfway through the school year. We have a lot of end of the year type things. We have the championships in basketball. We have uh, swimming and wrestling going on. And then uh, we'll go right into the I learned. And then all of a sudden we're, we're at the end of the year. Uh, we get uh, the eighth grade field trip. Uh, a lot of fun things happening. So I always look forward to the second half of the year after winter break. Um, and, and just uh, kind of the finalize. You start looking at what you're going to be taking for high school. And some of the seventh graders taking those eighth graders. So there's a lot of looking forward at the end of the second semester. Cool. Now let's go to basketball interviews. Nolan Smith. And what sport do you play? Basketball. So how do you guys' most, most recent game go? It went pretty good, but we lost by seven points. Am I here with? Caleb Alcester. Kill you, man. And what sport do you guys play? Basketball. basketball. So how, is, did, how did your most recent game go? Uh, it was pretty good. We scored a lot of points, and we won. Mm -hmm. It went well. I'm here with. Annie Davis. And what sport do you play? Basketball. So how did you guys' most recent game go? Um, it was okay. We lost, but we tried our best. That's good. Thank you for watching, Bulldogs. See you next week.